What is up, YouTube? The sneaker community. I got another kicks that just came in. Oh, man. I was waiting for these for so long. You just don't know. I had ordered these on GOAT. That's why I got these. Man, the seller must have put something or the box got damaged in transit. You know, I'm paying premium, so I expect my stuff to come as I as is described. And unfortunately, it didn't work out the first time. Goat did a great job with their customer service. Uh, you know, offer me credit or wait for the money to get refunded to my card. I end up just purchasing it again from a different seller. And it, it worked out. It finally came in. So I was like hella excited to get it. So, yes, this is a goat pickup. Um, as you already can see the box, you already should know what it is, at least the style of what the shoe is. And we let's, let's get right into it though. Jordan one retro high OG. Yes. You see the, the description of the, the colors. This is officially the bio hacks. These joints are fire. Let's get into it. Take the shoe out the box real quick so y'all can see. And obviously, yes, I bought from GOAT. I didn't, I wasn't able to get it on Nike. For those who got lucky, you know, luck to y'all. Uh, GOAT verified card and the, and the sticker. Y'all should know for those who order from the GOAT, how they operate. Um, Yeah, man. Yo, I was... I was dying for these. I tried for these and I could not for the life of me get these straight from Nike, but I still was able to get it from GOAT. And as you can see, these things are fresh, man. Just look at them. Look at the colors on these, man. These is too dope not to have in your collection. This is one of 2020's best Jordan 1 drops. You know what I'm saying? Everything is hype now, but I think this is one of the best Jordan drops to ever drop for right now. At least one of the best. Um, it may not be the best in some people's opinion, but I think these is the best, man. The materials, you know what I'm saying? They got the this like nice soft kind of suede or, or like velvet kind of feel a little bit right here. You know what I'm saying? It's just a combination of different things, man. The, the shoe just feels wonderful. It looks wonderful. The colors are, are radiant. You know what I mean? They pop. I mean, just look at it. Just look at it real quick. And you tell me what you think in the comment section because, man, this is the must-have. And I predict these on resale sites to go up eventually somewhere down the line. But that's just my prediction. I could be wrong. I'm not a reseller. So, you know. Take it with a grain of salt, however you want to take it. Got the lace bag. I'm definitely popping these in. I need to pop these in because with this right here and then the little hint of pink up here, I mean, how can you go wrong? You know what I'm saying? Just look at these bad boys, man. Look at this toe box. Dope. Look how they did the Nike Air on the tongue. And this is plush. Give you that off-white feel with the tongue. You know what I'm saying? Nice and soft. You know what I mean? It's a little different than what we know from the original Jordan 1s where they used to have the, you know, the tag that go over whether it's either leather or, or material. You know what I'm saying? Like these these are just too fire. And the, the pink laces is just going to make it pop even more. And if you got style and you know how to throw it together, it's going to all come together and it just might inspire somebody to go out and be like, you know what? I'm going to cop that shoe. That shoe is just too dope. So, as you can see, this shoe is fire. I'm going to keep saying it because that's what I strongly believe. It's just too fire. So, if you don't have these and you was contemplating on getting these in hand, it is worth it. It's worth the bread. It's a little bit, you know, a little over retail, not that much, which is great right now. Go get you a pair. You know what I'm saying? Throw these on feet. Put the put the different color laces in if that's what your thing is. And I even seen somebody online on Twitter bought 
glow in the dark laces. So I even might try that. You know what I mean? Shout out to whoever that person is that I can't. I don't have my um my Twitter account open, so I can you know give credit where credit is due. But that's a dope idea. You know what I'm saying? And this is what I love about the sneaker community that you can, you know, kind of get different ideas from different people. All this inspiration out here, you know what I'm saying? But um, tell me what you think in the comment section about the shoe. Danny, shit is too, too good right here, man. Tell me what you think in the comment section. Like, subscribe, and uh, until the next video, peace.